We'll talk about a testament to the talent we have in Central Texas. Almost every school here at Big 12 Media Days has at least one Centex athlete on its roster. The Longhorns have the most Central Texas flavor with players from Belton, Temple, Cove and Waco. Oklahoma, though, is right behind them with two former Midway Panthers and a former Rockdale Tiger. I caught up with Lincoln Riley today to get his thoughts on former Midway quarterback Tanner Mordecai, who he says has somewhat of an it factor. I'm excited to get on the field with him, you know, and just spend some more time with him. But I, uh, he just kind of has a little something about him. You know, it's hard to put your finger on as far as describing him as coaches and other people told me about it before I saw him live for the first time last spring. Uh, but you see it, you kind of feel it that he's just, he's got a little something about him and I think our players have already sensed that as well. And we can't forget about the state champion wide receiver from Rockdale, Jaqueline Crawford, who graduated in December and was an early enrollee for the Sooners. Riley says he's already made some big strides. And he's got the juice, he's got the excitement athletically that, that, that you look for. And so for him, it's just going to be a matter of consistency. Um, and, you know, we've got a tough rotation to crack now at receiver. You know, we've got some experienced guys that have been around, um, but he is, we'll be looking for a few more to, to kind of be ready to step up and, and take on those different roles that will present themselves throughout the year. And he's got a chance to do it. Crawford and Mordecai definitely both have bright futures ahead of them. I cannot wait to see what they do for the Oklahoma Sooners.